please welcome to the stage blue du double blue diamond and master distributor justin harrison Public service announcement, doTERRA family. Oh, someone's calling me. That's not it. <laughs> we have a carry-on black bag that is the Desley brand. So those of you that stowed luggage here today, this is really for you. Um, it is packed very full. It is a soft case bag. It is long champ navy blue with a purse on top. It's missing. Someone's mistakenly run off with it. So if you have retrieved baggage recently, it was in the back of the room by Hall E, rolled up by the door. It is Megan Fitzpatrick's. Her name and badge are in the pocket ID holder. She's flying home soon, maybe. Her car keys are in that bag, so she desperately needs that. So if uh, any of you that ret retrieve luggage could just look at that, and if that's you, just find a staff member and um, turn it into them, and they all know what to do with it. So, so a couple days ago, we had an event just for men. Who, men, who were there? Who was there? Freedom! Freedom, right? He was there. So there was 300 men in the room. We started the day with the haka. No, no, that's not happening today. Don't worry. <laughs> not happening. Uh, but it definitely got the testosterone flowing. It was, it was amazing. And it was super successful. Kudos to those that organized it. We're going to do it again. And it'll be bigger and better, and it'll grow from there. But the, the greatest thing happened at that event. There was 12 women that snuck in. <laughs> and one of them approached me after the event and said, this was the greatest doTERRA event I've ever been to. There was no line at the restroom. <laughs> and I thought for sure, oh, the content, you know, it's going to be. Uh, no, it was the restroom line. <laughs> so, okay, that's important. All right, so uh, in the next few minutes, we're going to talk about your OV, how to boost it. Um, just real foundational, bring it back to the core of what we do. This is it. Use, share, teach, right? What's missing from this? Does anyone know? The most important step. This is what we do, but we got to repeat, right? Use, share, teach, repeat. Use, share, teach, repeat. Over and over again. That's our business. Thank you for coming. <laughs> it really can be that simple, guys. It really, really, truly can. So, so as we look at our team members and our teams at large, and most importantly ourselves, what are the income producing activities that we are focused on? Because we can get super distracted with doing things that don't actually build our business, right? And there are only a few things that really do build our business. And we just shared them with you. Using the oils, sharing the oils, teaching others how to use the oils. Repeat. You could throw follow up in there and a few other things. Organizing the oils in your closet does not build your business. You cannot count that towards your business building time, right? Even though it might need to be done. So obviously focusing on those things that we can control because we don't control a lot of aspects of our business. True? True. Guess what? You don't control your team as much as you would like to. Right? We lead a volunteer workforce, and so you can control who? You. Right? You can control you and your efforts. So we focus on income-producing activities, and that minimum 15 hours a week, all of our research, my friends, all of our research has shown us that if you want to do this successfully as a business, we need 15 hours a week from you of income-producing activities. Okay, watching cat videos on YouTube doesn't count, right? Income producing back activities because eventually at some point we want to become a builder, right? Or would we rather be a leader? Who in here wants to be a builder? Raise your hand. Who in here would rather be a leader? 
Okay, good. Right room. So what's the difference? What's the difference between a builder and a leader? The difference is that a leader duplicates. This is so critical. Because if you're not duplicating, you feel like this. Some of you are just kind of dazed right now because you see yourself in that silly cartoon, right? You're spinning the plates, trying to keep everything in motion, trying to requalify at your rank while looking for those who are going to run the race with you. Let me ask this question. Is duplication real? Yes, it is. It's also essential. It's essential for your success. Duplication, without duplication, my friends, you have a job. You've hired yourself into a job. So duplication is essential, and you've heard this already today, that we have the secret sauce when it comes to duplication, don't we? We do, okay? We have empowered success. We have the guides that have been mentioned. We have the strength guide, which is phenomenal for helping you identify where you should focus and the strengths you should use to build your business. But please, let's not forget, this is customized to you, the rank guides, right? These are so important. And and based on where you are, just like was said earlier, don't try and absorb all of this at once. It will melt your brain and it will be overwhelming. And when we go into overwhelm, Laura Jacobs says it all the time, if we get into analysis, too much overanalysis causes paralysis, right? So too much is not always a good thing. And I would say that's the case here. So based on the rank you're shooting for, next is the guide that you should be spending some time in. So the train guide, if you're shooting for premier and silver, right? The lead guide, if your next one is headed to gold, Multiply for platinum and diamond, influence for blue diamond, and then eventually inspire to presidential diamond. Now, I know some of you will be tempted to peak. Don't do it. Don't do it. It can actually uh, detract and derail. Okay, the newest guide. How many of you have downloaded or purchased the sales guide? Can you raise your hand? Okay, so this, that's not enough of you. (sighs) <sighs> Could some of you raise both hands? <laughs> All right, well, that's going to change right now. Um, this was created, this was the brainchild of a lot of amazing people, phenomenal leaders in doTERRA, to create this and put this together in a way that flows, that makes sense, and that teaches. And it's been out for a few months now, not really too long, which is probably why most of you aren't super familiar with it. But what if... What if this was taken to a whole new level? What if we took the sales guide and broke it into little teeny pieces and put it all in video format and put it all online for you? And and what if it was an actual certification that you could earn? Just like going out and getting certified in AromaTouch. Where are my AromaTouch certified people? Okay. I I love you. What's the matter with the rest of you? Okay. So just like with AromaTouch certification, we're turning a corner now in doTERRA and offering another certification. And this one is becoming a sales pro in your doTERRA business. All right. So you should be very excited about this. And so I'm going to give you a taste um, of how this works, it was highly recommended that, uh, by the way, what time is it? Is it almost one o'clock? It's almost one o'clock. Oh, in four minutes. In four minutes, you're all going to get an email with a link to how to sign up for this course, okay? And there's going to be something else in that email, which I'll share with you in a second. Um, so you'll go to the website to become a sales pro in your doTERRA business. Here you can either download for free the guide, the sales guide, or if you've had the chance to purchase it and have the hard copy, I recommend having a hard copy, even if you've printed it out on your home printer or if you've ordered it, whichever, have it there with you as you go through the course. Okay, now, do you want to know what's in the course? The topics? Okay, here we go. 
We're going to move kind of fast. Ready? First, you have to listen to this dude. <laughs> okay? So we're going to start out talking about um, how to avoid feeling salesy or pushy, right, when selling doTERRA. By the way, check out the leaders that are involved in this. There's over 18 of us, right? Expert tips to finding new customers by Haley Hobson. The power of knowing why you are selling by Stephanie Martin. Um, breakthrough or be- breakthrough fear of being a salesperson. That's a huge uh, hang-up for a lot of us, right? By Aaron Anderson. The biggest secret to selling. I know what that secret is, but I'm not going to tell you. You have to let Casey tell you, right? Five mindset hacks to boost your sales, right? By Melody Watts. Are you loving this so far? You should. Kirsten Kirschbaum, five critical sales skills to build your business. Uh, And it just keeps getting better. Stephanie Martin, how to create massive results building your doTERRA business. Any of you want that? Okay, good. We'll keep going. Robin Jones, build your business using your unique strengths. Neil Anderson, nine proven steps to selling doTERRA. Okay, this series slays it. By the way, notice on the left-hand side, the percentage of completion. This is an actual course, certification course, like you would take online from a university. This is doTERRA school. Okay? This is doTERRA school, and it shows your level of completion. You can come and go. I took this entire course. It's three hours to do the whole thing. If you have a three-hour block, you can sit down and do the whole thing, or you can break it up into little pieces by videos and uh, finish it over a few days or a few weeks, however long it takes you. But when you come back, it will take you right back to where you left off, right? So it's beautiful. But notice how the percentage increases. It shows you where you are. So I'm about halfway done at this point. So Eric's going to teach us about simple ways to connect authentically. Then we have Molly Dayton. Oh, put your seatbelt on for this one. 12 genius tips for inviting people to classes. Um, Let's keep going. Jen Olam's going to teach us helping people to show up to the class or one-on-one. That's always nice. Butts in the seat is always helpful. (laughs) Someone to actually talk talk to. Neil Anderson, creating a need to buy. Betty Torres, how to teach a class so people want to sign up. Isn't that brilliant? And right in your own room. Neil again, why people buy. Casey, easy tips to sign up new customers. How to answer objections by Mandy Kuhn. Right? Two simple steps to book endless classes by Annette Jukes. How to never run out of customers by Holly Lowe. And with each video segment, guys, you do have to take a quiz. And by the way, I shouldn't say this. I did try to cheat just to see if you could, just to see if it would let you. And this system is smart. It wouldn't let me take a quiz if I hadn't watched the video. It wouldn't let me skip ahead to other sections because I tried that too. (laughs) Okay. It would just give me this nice little warning box that said you have to complete prior content before you can move on, right? So the quizzes are kind of fun. I actually did get a few questions wrong, um, but I managed to do okay on this one. If you can read, this was the question, what should you do with those people who don't enroll at the class? Uh, Option A was seek revenge. (laughs) B was continue to nurture the relationship and be pleasantly persistent. That's the one I picked. Uh, C was hold a silent grudge and unfriend them from Facebook. And D was crank up your efforts to enroll them. (laughs) Three or four targeted emails a week should do the trick. (laughs) So some of the questions are easier than others, right? But we have a little fun with that. Then we learned from uh, Rod Richardson on uh, that fortune is in the follow-up. This one's a hugely important topic. Then you come to near the end where you get to rate yourself on how you're doing on all of these different skills. And so some self-accountability there. And then we wrap up with massive business growth using the sales guide. Then when all of this is done, something amazing happens. You receive a certificate of completion.
from doTERRA. It's generated right there on your computer screen. So you can print it, you can save it, and it is logged at doTERRA, and I'll tell you why here in a, in a moment. And uh, you have successfully become a sales pro in your doTERRA business. Is that exciting? Now, what I'm very excited about this because personally what, how I'm going to use this is when we're hosting base camps or elites, primarily retreats, whatever it is, uh, I am actually going to make this a prerequisite for attendance. Right? A prerequisite for attendance. That's just something, that's just the way I'm going to use it. You can use it however you like. Now, just like with Aromatouch certification, with the Sales Pro certification, there is a cost. Okay? There is a cost. And it is $97. I've paid tens of thousands, if not hundreds of thousands of dollars for my education in this business over the years. But we've been talking with doTERRA. And they gave us a code. See that code down there at the bottom? It's 75% off. Okay? So I think if I'm not doing the math, but that puts it right around $24 or somewhere in there. You have to use the encode Empowered Success 75. Okay? The, The code... Oh, wait, there's more. The code is valid. They were actually going to only give us till tomorrow, and I pleaded for Monday. So it's good till Monday, because we all got to get home, right? So that we can share this, and in that email that you're getting any moment, if you haven't gotten it already, there will be some social media material and posting for you allowed to share this with your teams, so that they can also use the code. Okay? So it is very, very cool, and to make it even cooler... Once someone has completed the certification, doTERRA is going to award them with 100 points. Okay? Yeah. So, so if you do the math, this is a pretty freaking awesome deal. Right? So on Monday, my friends, we got to put the word out that they got to go in. Now, there's, there's something very important you need to know. The link they give you, you will go and you will sign up for doTERRA school. Don't you love the sound of that? doTERRA school, and that's free. Okay, that's free. Um, But then you have to choose your course, which is the sales pro certification, and sign up for the course. And that's where you'll have to put in all your information and the coupon code and all of that stuff. So make sure you do both steps. Otherwise, you're not really in the program. Everyone follow that? So it's a two-step process to get in. Okay? Sorry? International's coming. It's coming. Just hold on. They'll have it done next week. <laughs> Someone just wet themselves when I said that. No. <laughs> it's coming. Okay. So with all of this material and all of this content and all the great information we've been given, it's still from one of my mentors, <laughs> Albus Dumbledore. It's our actions far more than our ability that determine what we may become. Right Now, we have to use this, right? We have to work. Convenience is rarely, convenience rarely leads to things that matter. This requires a phenomenal amount of effort. Success requires effort. Success requires what? Failure. Success requires failure. Have any of you failed before? Okay, when I was in grade school... Um, I was not good at sports. I was usually better for the other team. Um, I don't know how many of you can relate to this, but if it was dodgeball or basketball or whatever it was, I was always the last one to be picked every single time. And that hurt sometimes. And I always felt, as I got a little bit older, that someday I would have a team where everyone was welcome. So thank you for building that team because it is you. It is you. And we're all going to fail. How many of you ever had a secret meeting? A secret meeting is when you have a class and no one comes. Okay, now how many of you had a secret meeting, right? Okay, look around. It's everybody. And so... So you're going to have, 
You're going to have a lot of that, okay? Now, here's the thing. Now, your failure is not final. Your failure is fertilizer. Your success will grow in the fertilizer of failure. But I do give you permission to fail faster and just get through it. Can I share with you a million dollar tip? Those that were at the men's event, you know what I'm about to do because we did it there. Just play along. Here's my first million dollar tip go out and suck. Right? Those of you that are new, or maybe you're not new, we still sometimes suck. So just do it. Right? Get it over with. Here's my second million dollar tip. Suck more. Now, we're having fun with this. But I really am serious. Everybody stand up. Stand up. You need to anyway. The mind can only absorb what the butt can endure. Stand up. Stand up. Okay, raise your arm. We are going to do the sucking declaration. So repeat after me. In building my doTERRA business, I will go forward and share. And I will suck until at some future day that I suck no more. All right, thank you. Put them down. <laughs> George Bernard Shaw, famous playwright and philanthropist, is quoted as saying that 2% of people think. That 3% of people think they think. And that 95% of people would rather die than think. Now, why is that? What is thinking? Thinking's hard. Thinking takes effort. So my encouragement to all of us as we leave this amazing week, it's over, I'm sorry. As we leave this amazing week, that we'll set aside some time early next week to really just sit back and think about everything that's happened this week, everything that we've learned, and what are we going to do differently? What are we going to implement? How are we going to evolve and change and grow because we all have a past do any of you know people that are stuck in their past I do we all have a past my biggest wish for you as we finish up my request for you on this day is that you will go forward and create, and I use the word create very much on purpose, that you will go forward and create your future with your future, not with your past. Thank you.